Hello Taurus, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your June 2022 monthly tarot reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So I hope you're well. Remember these readings won't be for everyone. Take what resonates with you as always. So let's see what we have for the month for you Taurus. Overarching energy first. We'll pull some general cards. Then look specifically at love, romance, relationships and money and career and any other message we get. It won't be for everyone. Just take what resonates with you as always. Two cards. And we have the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Okay. We have the Sun. The Five of Cups. The Knight of Swords. And we have the Four of Cups here. What do we have for Taurus, please? Angel Spirits Guides, message for Taurus, thank you. What do we have in love, romance, relationships for Taurus? Thank you. We have the High Priestess, trusting your intuition. And we have the Three of Pentacles. Let's, let's do money, career, finances for you for June. Angel Spirits Guide, thank you. What do we have for Taurus for June? Thank you. Money, career. So we have the Six of Cups, and we have the Seven of Cups. Yeah, bottom of the deck, yeah, that felt right. We have the Ace of Swords, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, Taurus, I'm going to pull an Angel Answer card, overarching message for Taurus, thank you. <clears throat> Look for a sign. So some of you might be reading a situation really well. High Priestess is here, which is always lovely and intuitive. But you know, the sun is real divine energy here. So it does feel like things are about to look up in a beautiful way. Yeah, I've got trust. Okay, what do we have for Taurus, please? Angel Spirits Guides. This is Surrender and Trust. Generally when the sun... You know, the sun is a great energy of, of happiness, joy, celebration, success. Uh, it's, it's, it can also be just everything feeling brighter. And there's an indication here of, of that's about to happen in June. Yeah, we have deception. Someone is wearing a false self-mask in this relationship. What do we have for Taurus, please? In money areas, money career finances. Organize for success. Do not let the word organize intimidate you as it is simply a way for you to ensure clarity of purpose. Organizing your thoughts, reports and your living and workspace and your finances will help you know and plan your next action steps. Okay, Taurus, I mean, let's have a look at money areas first. It feels in this energy... This is a feeling of the rainbow of blessings being returned. Uh, the rainbow after the rain. It does feel in this energy there's uplifting joy and happiness and uh, celebration and those cups are full. The ten of cups can be generally the idyllic scenario of happiness and joy and fulfillment in the home, the family, the relationship and whatever that, whatever level that appears to to resonate with you but it can be because something external has affected that and it feels in this energy some news some communication forward movement and transformation is coming in 
in the form of, and it comes in quite fast, is what I'm getting. Because we have the same message here. News coming in that just is joy, you know, the, the energy of joy and happiness and fulfillment. Um, for some of you, you might have been waiting to hear back on something here. And there's a strong indication of that coming your way. A significant message, news, information that you might have been waiting for here. But it's linked with, I mean, the, the sun can be a great success energy. So it does feel in this energy, it's linked to some success in money, career, finances. Because something got you down, you know, the five of cups can be mourning something that's gone. It can be to do with loss, looking back, sometimes making something that makes you feel down. Um, difficulty moving on from a situation. But it does feel in this energy you're getting the offer. And this is about trusting that the four of cups can be an offer. Um, and it's linked to your emotions and feelings and something that has the potential to change your, you know, your energy as well. So it does feel in this energy you're being given something here for consideration. Because this is almost kind of like answer prayers, the answer to your prayers here. Uh, that you're being told to trust, look for a sign. It does feel in this energy very good in terms of money, career, finances. You might need to be organized because there's a strong energy of things potentially coming in fast and quick. So you might need to make some changes. And this is just the energy of the happiness, reconnecting to your own happiness, but also bringing happiness back into the home family relationship. Um, it feels for some of you, you're getting the clarity that you need that you've been waiting for on a decision, something that you hoped would happen is happening here. This is a strong breakthrough energy and it links with victory and success here in the, on the money front. Uh, it's victory over whatever's gone on here before. I mean, this could also be if it's not straight jobs, it might well be that there's some kind of offer or monetary offer coming your way that's in the light of truth, you know? Um, it might well be in that scenario here. I mean, that could be anything in terms of inheritance or legal decisions or uh, money that you are waiting on in some way. If you're waiting for some kind of decision, this is getting that decision. This is getting the news that you've been waiting for. And it's like that's the breakthrough. So it might well be for some of you that's the case as well. But it does feel in this energy really beautiful. This is definitely an energy of... It feels like major breakthroughs, communication coming your way, things moving fast. And you might just get signs leading up to this. You might just get intuitive nudges, signs, um, even things that mean something to you, people from the other side just sending you blessings, messages, support, you know, that can come in a variety of ways. But it does feel in the energy here that you're getting the news that you've been waiting for and things are really moving in a, things take a turn in a positive way, I feel. So that's a lovely message for you. Now, in love romance relationships, we do have deception here. There's levels, you know, the word deception can sometimes be a little bit, you know, um, strong. You know, it can be on different levels. Lies, deception, doing something covertly, not being above board. So there's levels to this in all angles. However, it does feel like there are positive shifts happening here uh, in the home, the family, the relationship. It does feel in this energy things start moving in the right direction. Could be down to some kind of conversation. Conversation that you're having here. Because there's a strong energy here of trusting your intuition. Now, it's not about emotions. It's not about your mental um, perception of a situation. Because sometimes when we deal with a level of deception, we can let the logical brain lead the way, we can let our heart lead the way, and we can sometimes respond in that energy. The High Priestess is asking you to trust your intuition, your inner voice, your inner 
truth almost, that inner voice from spirit, God, the universe that is guiding us. And in this case, it's to do with rebuilding a relationship or having the opportunity to rebuild something. For some of you with deception being here, it could be a trust issue as well. Because there is, there's an energy here of regret, someone's sorry. Now this could be, this could be in the relationship itself, this could be with a child, uh, could be with wider family as well, wider extended family, building bridges, there could be an energy here of that as well here, Taurus. Um, so again, it's not just about a relationship itself, it can be to do with, like I said, members of the family, children, um, extended family and so on and so forth. This is an energy of somebody who regrets their actions and they're offering you something here and it feels like some kind of peace offering. It might well be for some of you, if it's to do with family or extended family, then there will be a breakthrough, in, a breakthrough um, in the sense that somebody reaches out and starts the conversation going on. Because there's definitely an energy, a conversation is taking a turn for the better. This is healing energy, um, putting it behind you, you know, this difficult, putting any difficulty, be, difficulty behind you and stepping onto into the light, happiness and joy and uplifting energy and healing. Um, as a result of conversations going on. So like I said, that can be in a relationship, it can be with family, wider family, children and so on. But it does feel in this energy rebuilding step by step. It feels, if it is, it's slowly but surely, uh, slowly but surely having an opportunity to rebuild. If it's trust, it's taking it one, t one day at a time and just intuitively, being guided in terms of how that progresses is what I'm getting, but it does feel like there's illumination on a way forward here is what I'm getting. So I'm going to see if I've got any other message for you. Some of you could be, I mean, other kind of like niche, messages I'm getting some of you could be doing up a home or a property some of you could be exploring things like property development some of you could also be considering traveling or even going to stay with family friends and reconnect on that basis or decide to take a holiday. It just feels in this energy, maybe travel will play a part in June, which obviously is a summer moon, so it likely will for some of you. But it does feel an energy that there's real positive and uplifting energy here, Taurus. Certainly in terms of how you're dealing with the situation, I feel you're getting the the enlightenment that you need, but also in terms of decisions coming to you, it feels like you're getting some clarity is what I'm getting. Okay. Final message for Taurus. Yeah, see, manifestation we have. And manifesting is, is turning something negative to positive, an idea to reality, base metal to gold. So we have believe in magic, which is a manifesting energy. Open your eyes and see the magic that's all around in nature. The fairy of the northern light says you are part of nature, so you are magical too. This is real transformation available to you and change. That's what I have for you, I hope you enjoyed the reading, found it helpful, useful. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I will see you next time. Thank you.